cool people who are joining me here on the Raising Wellness channel again. I'm so excited that you're here and ready to dive in to our meditation today to help with anxiety. I am surrounded by so many people who are challenged with anxiety, fear of the future, you know, guilt from the past, all of those things that can attribute to feeling fear and anxiety in your here and now in your present moment. And I definitely am not someone who has been immune to anxiety or depression as I've shared in my other videos on this channel. So I am right there with you. I have gone through the motions that maybe you're going through right now. And this meditation, meditation in general, has helped me a lot to calm that fear, reduce that anxiety, and get back into being here and now in the present moment from a place of feeling love and connection. So we're going to dive right into the meditation. I know you guys like to jump right in, so let's get started. sitting on your couch, in the driving seat when you're parked, or maybe you're sitting in a chair at your desk in a library. Just find a comfortable seated position and close your eyes. And take the next few moments to tap into your breath. the 
outer edges of your body melt into the air around it. Taking a deep breath in. Finding your exhale. Using it to release and relax any tension. Melt away any stress. controlling your breath and instead flowing with it using it naturally as a tool easily breathing in and naturally exhaling to release and melt
abundance surrounds me. Love surrounds me. Life is in perfect harmony. Abundance surrounds me. Love surrounds me. Life is in perfect harmony. mantra within your inner world within your mind for the next few minutes allowing it to resonate deeply within you connecting only with those words for the next few minutes An abundance surround me. Life is in perfect harmony. abundance surround me. Life is in perfect harmony. in perfect harmony. And take a deep breath in through the nose. And as you do so, draw your awareness up to your third eye. Bring that affirmation up to your third eye. that you may see it as truth, your truth. Love and abundance surround me. My life is in perfect harmony.
take a deep breath in through the nose. And as you find your exhale, allow those feelings that you've cultivated to flow out of you and towards someone you love. Sending that energy to someone you care about. gratitude here. One thing to be grateful for. And as you do so, draw your hands down your midline, placing them over your heart. Wrapping yourself in the feelings of thankfulness and gratitude and appreciation for all the work you did today. Although a few minutes of meditation may seem small, in 
the long run, it's huge. As you practice more and more, come back to this meditation or come back to others, you will slowly begin to see shifts, shifts that you've created in your mind through practicing stillness. surrounded by and see if you can keep this connection this feeling that you've cultivated during meditation alive and awake while your eyes are open see how long you can move through your day keeping this feeling for taking this time for yourself, for meditating, for practicing meditation. And please remember that this isn't about how good you did or how long you can keep the feeling of this practice going. It is a practice. It is something that shouldn't be judged or compared. It is simply your own practice, your own time to get back in touch with that stillness inside of you and I also wanted to talk about a few things post meditation with you guys that are new and I wanted to tell you about so one I am sorry that these meditations haven't been coming out regularly but it's been very difficult for me to find a space in my home where it's quiet, especially with a German Shepherd that's in her terrible twos and very much loving her voice, um, to say in a kind way. So it's been very difficult, especially in the city too, to find a quiet space. So I'm coming to you from my office. You guys may be hearing noises from the road outside. You know, you might hear birds because I have a lot in my backyard in the mango tree here, but I, decided that it shouldn't stop me from sharing these meditations with you guys, especially because meditation is something that can happen anywhere, no matter what distractions are going on around you. When I teach meditation at a local espresso lounge coffee shop here in Florida, there's lots of noises. There's construction outside. Sometimes people open the door, they don't realize that we're meditating. Um, and we still move through the practice and that's really what it's about is being able to bring in your practice when there's tons of other distractions and chaos that may be happening outside of you. So that is a big thing and I think that might be it. I just really wanted to tell you guys about that. I'm also going to be doing some more stuff on this channel about moving slowly, organizing your life, moving from a space of stillness and flow rather than that space of hustle and grind because I know personally for me that was a big thing that you know burnt me out and it didn't produce the best work, it didn't allow me to give my best to the people that were around me and the world at large. So I'm going to be sharing a lot more about what I've been doing instead of that and how incredible it has been for um, finding my flow, manifesting creativity, you know, manifesting, huge. I know I already said it, but like crazy things have been happening, you guys, and I cannot wait to share all of the alignment with you on this channel. I hope to hear from you guys. Write stuff in the comments below. I love when you write in there and let me know that you're tuning into the meditations and that they're helping you in some sort of way. It just really allows me to know what to keep providing you guys with, what is necessary and needed out there from all of you all over the world. And so just let me know what you want to see more of, what you need more support with. And I'm sending you guys so much love, so much gratitude as always, and I'll see you next time.